How y'all doing today? This is Damani, the disciple of God. I talk about locks and I talk about God. This is my lifestyle. I hope that you enjoy the content that I do put out. This is just me and my feedback. And when God puts it on my heart to talk about, I get on here and I talk about locks and I talk about God. That's pretty much it. Today with a coworker, I talked about him using the statement of saying he is a God. To say that you are God, okay, I get it. You're thinking highly of yourself. You have confidence within yourself. But to say that you're a Christian, you're a man of God, and to say that you are a God is wrong. If you are a God, that means that you rely on your own strength. You rely on yourself for everything. That means that you don't need God. So if you're a man of God and you're saying that you are a God, then are you truly a man of God? Because the Bible says that you were made in God's image. You're not a God. I also talked to him about manifesting. I told him that manifesting is, I guess you could say when, when, when God created everything, earth, uh, when he created the heavens and the earth, he basically spoke it into existence. That's the power of God. I guess you can call that manifestation, but you cannot do that. So for someone to say they are a God is basically putting yourself at the same level of, as God. When Jesus came and God sent him in the flesh, he came and he was perfect. He was unflawed. He came, he came to save humanity. For you to sit here and, 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 and say that you are a God and to say that you're up there with God, the Father, and, and, and God, the Son, Jesus, is, is crazy. I understand. Think highly of yourself. But what's the point of you saying you are a man of God when everything that you say is contradicting the Bible? Another thing that, I was, that was talked about was the Bible was a contradiction. He said that he was a man of God. He said that the things that Christians talk about are a contradiction. We all know God is not a God of confusion. If you read John 1.1, 1, 1, it also says in the beginning of time, the word was God and God was, I don't know the exact verse, but John 1.1 1, 1, or 1 John 1.1, 1, 1, read that. I, I, I pulled that up for him. Basically saying that the Bible, the word is God. The Holy Spirit and the people who wrote those books within the Bible, those people were basically appointed by God, which is the word of God. So if you're saying that it contradicts itself, we know that it's not possible. I told him, if you don't have the discernment, you don't have the Holy Spirit, you, you, you can't understand it. You're going to say, you're going to find every reason to say you're God, to put yourself on the same pedestal as God. You're going to find every reason to sit here and say you can manifest stuff or you're more spiritual but you don't get down with the religious aspect, but everything that you do and your fruits don't add up. So I say that to say, I get it. Everyone has their own personal beliefs, but you have to point to the facts and the truth. So you can call yourself a God, you can call yourself a goddess, however you want to say, but you are not a God. It's, 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 it's the simplest way to put it. You're not a God. You are made in the image of God, meaning you want to be a billboard. You want to be on the side of the, you know, you want to be in public and you want to display what it's like to know God, what it's like to be a child of God, but you're not a God because you were born in sin. You're not perfect. Your heart is evil. Your heart is wicked. Your mind, your mind is evil. You got to pray to God for cleansing every day. You rely on God for everything. If you were God, you wouldn't need God. That's as simple as it is. God bless y'all. I hope I didn't go too much of on a rant. If you like this content, subscribe down below, comment down below, and just give me your feedback. I know there is a big community of uh, people that are, are more uh, spiritual, I guess you can say, or I call it the third eye community, the woke community. I, I would like to hear their feedback and why they feel as though they are God and why they feel as though something in the Bible shows them that they are God because I hear this from a lot of people who, who call themselves Christians. So comment down below, subscribe to the channel, 
like the video and share the video if you don't mind. God bless y'all. This is Damani, the disciple of God. Put it on YouTube what, what, what God has put on my heart and what I feel today. I thank y'all for tuning into the video.